Welcome to the Academy of Electrical Construction Management. And in this video, we're going to introduce you to the Academy and kind of get you started so we can get you into the campus and let you kind of look around, see how it works, see what, um, what we've done with the curriculum. For, and this is really um, mainly focused towards project engineering. So what we've done is in this video, we're going to give you just a general insight into how this self-paced educational system will work for you, enhancing your abilities as project engineers in the electrical industry. And the difference between our academy and what your typical college is, is that we're really more focused on giving you the hands-on knowledge that usually comes with years of experience in the industry so that you can take your current level of education and tailor it to really fit into the, your everyday work experience. So it's really more on-the-job training type stuff. So you get into a lot more details because each company has certain different ways to do it, but they're all the same functions that have to occur over and over and over. So this gives you a basic platform as a project engineer to be able to move from one job site to the other and always be able to understand how the systems work and, and what you need to do as an engineer. And by giving you the opportunity to study how it really works at the job site level, the goal of the academy is to allow you to grow as quickly as possible in your career. So, and at the same time, we don't want it to affect your home responsibilities and or your work. So, it's really the self-paced is a new um, a technology that's really only come into its existence in the last three years. And um, so, we're one of the first to really get out there and take advantage of it. And just with, as within any college, you know, our first step is to learn where, how to get around the campus and to know what our classes are, the general lay of the land related to how's the student lounge work in the library. And because it is electronic, these are just simple clicks of the mouse to get you to certain places. So to show you how easy it is, we're going to go ahead and show you uh, the, the screens that are going to be popping up at you. So you kind of get a, a pre-orientation on how it works. So to get started, um, it's very simple by just clicking open your browser. And you can see here we have a little graphic here that just is real simple. And this would be as if you're using Chrome, but you're, you may be using Outlook. It's going to be the same thing. And if you just um, open a new tab and simply type in this um, address right here, it's HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash AECM, which is the Academy of Electrical Construction Management dot forums dot org, boom, you're in the login screen. And once you get to the login screen, you're going to see a screen right here pop up. You're going to click on that login and then go ahead and use these guest passwords for now until you get a chance to see if you really want to enroll in the Academy. And then this will give you a lot of uh, free space to go play with. A lot of classes you can go kind of audit if you wanted to. Um, there's hundreds of videos in here related to all the different functions. So feel free to use it as a guest and take advantage of the many classes that we have available. And once you decide you want to enroll into the academy, you'll have full access to all the libraries, the tests, the surveys, everything. So, and when you're ready to uh, enroll, just drop us an email at management at aecm.solutions. So that's essentially what we have. Now, once you've logged in, um, our next step is, let's see what it looks like when we first get in. So we're going to go ahead and log in. And here again, this is the aecm.forms.net. We do our login. And then I will go ahead and go in as myself because it happens to remember me. And, um, and this will remember you as well once you get in. 
So once you open the academy, this is what you're going to see. And each one of these are kind of um, here for a reason that we can roll them up and roll them down. So for instance, I'm going to roll them down for the moment so we don't have to look at all this stuff. And then I can roll down that I want to do Welcome to the Academy because I'm just getting started. And that's where we are right now. We're in the orientation to the Academy. So by clicking on that one orientation to the Academy, it's going to take you straight in to where you have two parts of, the, uh, of this class right here. The first is the discussion board and the second is the individual assignment and this is going to be typical for every class you take within here. So the first thing we generally try and do is use the discussion board to get you through the hard skills, the things that you got to kind of know to make it all work and then in the individual assignments we, we fine tune that and build all your soft skills, all the the innuendos, all this little secret tricks that make it work for you to stand out as a professional in the industry. So in our case we're going to go to the module one discussion board and once you've done that you'll see that there is now classroom materials and that's where we want to go is we wanted to start with our classroom materials and there we are I and mean, we have now this module one discussion board orientation is really where this video that you're watching right now is also contained at. So when you come in here this is our original orientation to the to this board and then you can see here getting started right there so that's this video that you're watching right now and then as we get further into it we'll have more videos below it as you'll see that we have the self-paced approach. We get into a little bit more detail there. So there's a load of information here. And we're try we try and keep these as short as possible. So that if you, you, can, you can get through it in about 10 minutes. Then decide if you want to go to the next one. If you ever need to go back. Or you need to look it up a year from now. It's real easy for you to do. So then we just, as you can see how easy it is to navigate, you just click on these little boxes up here. And now we're back into it. So there's a bunch of classroom materials. This is Meet Your Instructors, Standards of Content Within the Industry, uh, Standards of Behavior Within the Campus, um, Hardware and Software are Required in Case You Wanted to Use Your Home Computer. And then uh, there's another more involved video here that helps you further understand how to navigate if you're having some problems in the navigation. And then there's a netiquette, which is just basic etiquette of how to use the internet properly in a classroom environment. And the last one is, a, is just basically an assignment. And so for the assignment for this um, uh, this classroom materials that we've just looked at is not a big deal and we're not trying these are not graded or anything like that it's we're really taking the opportunity with these assignments here to really just to get to know each other a little bit better so we're asking you guys to just write up a real simple narrative on three different things um, you know get into somewhat of a description of your goals within the industry um, we'd kind of like to know how you feel about team management. Um, how have you been trained for that? How, how well do you feel like you, you're in tune to that? And then how you feel you could be best used within the company. And here again, this is um, strictly up to you guys to do what you want to do there. And just fill it in. Just give us a couple paragraphs. Or if you want to go into great detail, that's fine as well. And then if when once we get your comments, it gives us a chance to kind of get some peer review back to you. So we get you some guidance and and things that may help in the in the process. So it's really like I said, just don't make a big deal out of it. Um, and when you're finished with it, just send your assignments and any comments or questions you may have. And this is a good place to ask any questions if you're. <laughs> 
uh, confused about something and just send it to us at testing at aecm.solutions. And then we have another email address just in case you guys have other things that come up that you can just pop us at management at the same um, email at aecm.solutions and we'll get with you within, an hour, within a day and try and help you out however we can. So this is essentially what it is to get started. And so there's a, quite a wealth of videos in here that will really kind of give you a better idea of how the academy is starting. And then once you're finished with the um, discussion board, then you'll do the same thing when you get to the individual assignment. And you can see it right here is an individual assignment. It has a classroom materials for it as well. And you will then notice that there's going to be videos over here. This introduction video for module one individual assignment. And then there's some other um, uh, pieces of information just on goal setting and things like that. That are somewhat related to the individual assignment for this module. And so once you're finished, just go ahead and finish up that individual assignment. Um, it's got a very similar um, assignment as the discussion board did. And it's just asking some questions about your goals and, and those type of things. And so that's essentially, how, with that said, we've just now gone through the first module of this class. And then as we get further into it, you're going to notice here that we'll go back to the very beginning and we'll see that there's three basic modules. Um, whoops, I clicked on the wrong one there. Grab my messages instead. Okay, yeah, so you can now see that there's a module one, a module two, and a module three. And these are just welcome to the academy type stuff. So use them as you wish. Um, if you feel like you're making a great bit of progress and it's pretty easy to pop around, then go ahead and open up your project, your level one project engineering classrooms. And for the time being, we've left one class up here for you to go demonstrate and play with. And then we'll start turning on the rest of the classes as we start getting more and more people into it. And then they start advancing up the curriculum. So here again, that's pretty much how easy it is to get started. So we hope you enjoy your experience inside the Academy and uh, let us know if there's anything we could do to help you. Thank you very much.